Welcome, I'm Anala to New Road, Wonderful Gaming. So today, we're killing the Ender Dragon and going exploring some end cities and building the village of Trading Hall, starting right now. Well, everybody, you might notice something. I have had a small upgrade. Small upgrade. Right, I've made myself a full suit of netherite, uh, two, no, sorry, three full diamond pickaxes, a pickaxe, a full netherite pickaxe, uh, a stupid amount of beds, yeah, I use bed mining, and uh, managed to get enough materials to craft one and enchant it. Um, it's been a, oh, a bit of time since I've played, uh, or done anything else, and we have a small nether portal to here, because below me, down that hole, is the fortress. We're going to go kill the end drain, so stay tuned, we're going to go do that right now. Okay, we're in the uh, fortress. I have already been in Yarrow once already. Um, I know where the, the portal is. So I've actually put the eyes of in already. Okay. And so we're just going to go straight there. It's off to the right here. I just need to get rid of my friends here. Get rid of him. So I've done a lot of the prep work for this fight already. I've got a totem of undying, I've got a whole bunch of... I am going to attempt to one cycle it. Don't think I'm going to do it I'm not a speedrunner, but I will try it. Um, I've got some impulse, I've got some food, I have got should have enough arrows, I've got my new bow. Yes, I made a new bow, as you can see in there. The gunpowder farm is working a treat. Because I can put the lava away and then just convert it into a slice and dice farm. Alright, but let's get busy in the going to the ender. Okay, now that I've got my software fixed, uh, welcome back. Uh, I have been busy. Uh, so I destroyed the, uh, the crystals around the dragon. He did manage to kill. I haven't tried the one cycling yet. Um, and uh, I actually need to do that. And I'm actually going to swap out that as well. Um, I've been through quite a bit of food already, I've used all my steak, I've used quite a few... Oh, oh, oh. No time to talk. Okay, uh, Wasn't too bad. That was out, out, out. Um, obviously, I said I am not a speedrunner, but um, that wasn't too terrible. I don't think. Um, so, if three and B just turn that off. So I can't hurt it like that, can I? I forgot about that. Out, 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 out. So we're just going to do this. The fashion way. And that was close. I, I meant to win. Um, I'm quite actually chuffed with that. Um, my timing, I'll need to practice this. Admittedly, I have been doing that. Oh, my aiming is terrible. Um, I have been practicing a bit on, on uh, using the one cycle. That was probably one of my most successful attempts yet. Um, I've got a separate roll to basically do it in. Oh, that was close. Are you coming in again? And one more should do it. There we go! Yes! Alright, beautiful. That actually went a lot easier than I thought it would. Okay, so our next thing that we're going to be doing today is we're going to go get ourselves a set of Elytra because that's why I actually came to the end. I'm tired of walking, I've got a gunpowder farm, I want to make rockets. So that is exactly what we're going to be doing next. We're going to be going, um, I believe the portal is back that way. I'm going to have to mine some um, net, uh, endstone and um, go through the portal. 
So let's do that. Alrighty, we have got a little stairway to heaven here, so we're just going to check our ender pearl and um, throw it through and see where we land up. And now we need to find a, an end a city. Oh wow, that is convenient. Sometimes I feel like I should bring a pumpkin head. This is a, a lot of endermen. I'm going to have to, you know what? Um, I suppose I do have a sword, hey? Uh, let me just heal up first. Totem, but I really don't want to use it if I don't have to. Alright, so I think if I. Ooh! Ow! Okay, I'm just going to heal up uh, a bit and then we all go across there. Because <laughs> that nearly got me dead. And then we'll just toss that one. Eee! Onto that side. I definitely think I'm going to finish off the villager farm so I can um, get some carrots, so I can make golden carrots. All right. All right. Beautiful. Let us do this. Should I actually brought a shield, but hey. to use the bow to kill off this shulk as the shulker boxes because I really don't want to float everywhere. I can't. I, it's been a lot of time since I've done this. Um, okay. We'll just have to play it carefully and slowly. as long as you manage where you fall. Alright. Because it does event like now it's about to wear off so okay so let us speed through this and I will go kill some more shulkers and uh, get our leecher on the on the ship. So enjoy your time lapse. <laughs>
making some good progress, I do think. What I'm not seeing is the ship. I'm not thinking there is one here, which is a bit of a concern. Hmm. Okay, much traveling, and I do mean much traveling. I've finally found a ship. I've actually found two ships, so we're going to get on board after we kill our friends. And, um, whoop, that's a bit over. Come on. And, um, yeah, uh, I've been through the, the, like four or five cities at this point to get here. And, um, I am uh, rapidly running out of food. This nuisance, and then we're going to get rid of the other one. And I don't have any rockets on me, so I actually need to get back. I haven't been looting the the end cities, by the way. Yay! Finally, it's just that it hasn't until I get the Elijah. It's just the sheer amount of time it's taking me to get here. Um, yeah. So I'll have to come back for this, and I do want the dragon's head. Um, you know, because I want it. Just gonna run over there. All right, guys, got the second pair of Elytra. Um, what I am going to do instead of the mistake I made last time. Um, so what I'll do is I'll come out here. Like so, and then here. Okay, I'm going to go find a portal to get me back to base. So, so, <laughs> you see my health, I need to get killed by an Enderman because, um, yeah, I looked at one by mistake and he proved to be quite um, annoying to kill. So, yeah, uh, here we go. And back to the beginning and now we're just going to run back to here so we can um, go back home because I'm out of food. Um, yeah, out of food basically is the main problem, and flying around, I, I literally walked my backs out of, eventually found an ender city, as I said, I ran past three or four, but if I didn't see the ship, I just didn't even bother, so, yeah, uh, so, next you see me, I, we're going to, the next part is going to be the village of trading hall, so we'll get started on that next. Well, everybody, it's fantastic to be back in base and have achieved something instead of just gathering resources for a change. So what we have done is we've got our first villager pod done. Okay, I still need to finish the roof off. I need more dark um, oak, or not oak, but I need more th um, this, no, the, the spruce, the spruce planks. I need more of the raw stuff um, to finish off that side. But essentially, each of the villager pods are going to look something similar to this. Uh, they're going to run down both sides, so you'll come down the corridor, and on the right is our Liberian villager pod. There are five stations for it. I really like the way this has come out. We've got a couple of couches that you can read some books, some overhead lamps to light up your pages, and um, the villagers. What are you doing in there? These uh, things. So you've got your lecterns with some books and quills and all of this good stuff. I, I like the way this came out, so I still need to put in the pistons, I need the, re, uh, make the rest of the mechanism for these guys to stand on, and obviously I need to put the villagers into them. So I'm going to build everything we need, and then when we'll be back, I'm going to have placed in all the bits. And well, we've got, I think, oh there he is, I think we've got everything we need, I want to buy 
this uh, black dye of him because I can now make emeralds relatively cheaply. So I'm just going to buy a little bit there. All right. So what I want to do here is I'm going to be putting in the pistons um, like that. And then I just need the levers, which I've got on me as well, and pop my lever on the back, like so. Um, and actually, yeah, what is, yeah, okay, cool. So that needs to go there, like that. Okay, that one I don't need to worry about. So it's just a case of rinse, repeat. Whoa, don't do that. Okay. Get out of it. I was trying to be nice, but he keeps getting in the way. So we're just going to rinse, repeat this a couple more times. And like that. All right, perfect. And then we just need to break that. And we need to put some levers on these guys, break the sound. Like so. These are the wrong pistons. I need sticky pistons. Okay, so that's that done. That's the way we're going to kill our villagers. You pull that piston back, you let them drop down, and you squish them, essentially. Uh, what I do need to do is I just need to actually break out those blocks underneath them, and then put a block there so they can't escape. All right, beautiful. Just rinse and repeat. Do I have any more blocks? I do not believe so. Okay, well, I'll just nick it from there then. All right, I'll fix that all. I actually want to come back in here and put uh, proper materials down there. Now, the rest of this is quite easy. It's just some string. So you put a piece of string in front of each of the observers. And then we need, now need to chop some uh, stuff apart on top. And I need to make a new axe because I broke my other nice axe. Right, uh, there, no, is it there? No. I think it's roughly... Yeah, it's here. Okay. I'm going to cut through all of this and we'll be back once I'm done with that. We are basically complete with all the mechanics for the redstone, all the contraptions are complete. How this works, so you will have rail cart coming through here, and then the rail carts will dump the individual villagers into the pod. Once they fall through the, the string, it perfectly powers the trap, and then it closes the black stone above their heads, which traps them and keeps them safe all in one. And then if they, you don't like their drops or whatever the case may be, you can flick the lever on the piston below them, flick it back, squash their heads, and they suffocate, and then they die. Um, so that's essentially how this works. Um, I need to chop out this log here because it's in the way. And then I will start bringing some villagers up. Um, I've got the rails on me, so the villagers will be coming up here. And then all of this needs to go away because, as I said, it is in the way. And then I'll be finishing off this roof, and then our first librarian uh, village breeder pod will be nearly complete, which is freaking fantastic. After this, I am going to focus on the farmers. I need farmers as well because they need, give me some nice stuff, and then it'll probably be the iron guys after that. All right, we're back. So what we have done is I made some splash potions of weakness. I've made some gapples or golden apples, and I've thrown them onto these guys here. So we're just waiting for them to cure up, and um, just do all of that. I'm just curious. Is it because I haven't been? Uh, it's probably because I haven't been around this area a lot. Okay, I'm gonna have to. Um, get rid of him at some point somehow, maybe some lava. Um, so I'm going to wait for these guys to cure up. I've got two minecarts there, and as soon as they're ready, I'll send them off to the <laughs> librarian uh, building, and then we'll have two new, or three new librarians all waiting for us, which will be pretty freaking cool. One out of three so far, and it's only going to be two out of three. The other one... Um, it converted again back into a zombie and then yeah, it got baked by the sunlight. So it's going to break him down there like that. Now, oh, really? 
please don't tell me that was my freaking villager. I'm not going to be happy if that was my librarian. Hey, you. Come here. Alright. That didn't actually turn out too badly. I must just close the doors. Alright, and we can see pretty good trades. Alright, so we're going to get the last one in here. The last one of the three, so two of the three, is now in. And you know, one book for Fortune 1, that's not too bad. Not too bad at all. And you give me... Okay, so I'm going to have to level these guys up, which I'll do off camera. I'm going to max them out. Uh, so he needs paper uh, to start off with. And you also need paper. Um, yeah, I need to rebuild my uh, paper farm. My sugarcane farm. Uh, now, I really don't have a choice. The, the gunpowder farm needs a bit of tweaking. It's doing okay. Um, you can see there. It's actually not doing too badly. I just need to spend more AFK time so it can get busy. But yeah, that's all we're going to have time for in this episode, guys. We've got a huge amount done. New netherite armor. The Liberian uh, section is essentially complete, except for two more Liberians, which I'm going to go convert now. I just heard one of them grow up. So I'm going to go do that. When we'll be back, I'm going to build the uh, bamboo farm, not sugarcane farm. I'm going to rebuild that. Uh, bigger, better. And uh, we'll be back very soon with more. Hope you enjoyed. And stay tuned for the outro. So everyone, we got a huge amount done there. Ender Dragon killed. And we explored some end cities. Now, next episode, we are killing the Wither Boss. We're going to finish the village. We're trading all the whole building with all the... All the different trades in it and we're going to upgrade all of them in between episodes we're going to expand the gunpowder farm and the sugar cane farm i hope you guys enjoyed it please do give it two thumbs up share the content far and wide and please do remember to smash that subscribe button until next time keep safe keep well and love you lots cheers for now